Hello again, hello again. Um, I have lost my plants, and I actually lost them before restarting. Uh, I was looking at uh, I was looking at the footage, the last set of footage, to figure out where I was because I forgot. And this uh, was empty, and I think that uh, this was empty because the plants had had stressed the hell out. So. Let's see if we can make a housing to control growth with. Um, I can, so there we go. I also have a trader brought down. I brought him down before the uh, the end of the last episode, but I don't know if I'm going to include that footage because it was right at the end and OBS decided to kill itself. Uh, for some reason, OBS doesn't like recording stationers for more than like um, an hour and ten minutes but only stationers I recorded RimWorld for like four or five hours and uh, it was absolutely fine when RimWorld is running my computer is unstable can I make an ID 10 chip <gasps> no I need gold I don't have gold gold is the thing that I need okay so we're gonna put you Right there, like that. And... I also... Uh, looked it up and did some experiments, and apparently... Um, Venus has very shallow topsoil. So, we won't be using a miner, even though I want to use a miner. And I don't remember if I completed that or not, I don't think so. Um, we still haven't even reached the point I was when I uh, first uh, when I first played this and I was ill. Okay, and this is four. We are going to start, we're going to actually fully automate our airlock. Even though I kind of like having, you know, discrete control over it. I might make an airlock program. Oh, no, I need this. And I am going to put in a composite door. There we go. Now what do I need first? I need plastic sheets plastic sheets and let's see how much this raises the temperature temperature is 26 degrees it is still 26 degrees and now it requires glass sheets with a crowbar glass sheets with a crowbar There we go. We'll leave that one for now. So is there gold in any of these other things? No, I have no gold. So I'm gonna need to get gold or find gold or do something with gold. Um, let's keep the coal in here. There we go. Just trying to orientate myself for a minute here. Oh, uh, there's lead. I forgot that I had lead. Okay, so I don't want to do this until I have a, a, um, control chip because I don't want to have to turn the um, the lights on and off apparently just turning it on and off to the Sun on Venus is not a good idea although I thought Venus had the same day night cycle as Earth I could be wrong oh well oh uh, no I have to upgrade that uh, that other printer for that. Air tank critical. Okay, so 
Got the nice air tank. We got the nice uh, mitt. Oxygen low. Oxygen's not low. And let's start venting. What is our... Let's see what he has. Uh, yeah, he has a glitch. Okay, sort of cards. He doesn't want to give us much for it. Uh, he's got lead, he's got iron, he's got copper, he's got waste, pastaloy, incanel. Ooh, he's got he's got ice, electrium, iron. But no gold. Okay, you know what? You stay there, and you go to hell. And I will... Go find... Some gold. On my own. And there it is. Why is it every time I start playing that, the phone rings? Or the neighbors start making noise. And it only happens when I'm recording. I could play a game for hours and hours and hours. But I guess when they hear me speaking to myself, they decide they're going to pound on the wall and stomp on the floor and all kinds of shit. Oh, I'm so funny. I'm going to interrupt a recording. Yeah, I'm going to find out what you do. And I'm going to... I'm going to make fun of you or something. I don't know. Jetpack on. Oh, this is... Light on. Now, the thing is, is that I could put this light on, and it'll cost less power. But it's also less bright. But it costs less power. Now, I still might use the ogre, but the ogre is terrible. It takes a lot of energy. It is very slow. If it was faster, it wouldn't be so bad. Like, if it was about four times faster, I would say it would be useful. But it is not. It is exceptionally slow. Um... The deep miner might be useful, but we're a ways away from that. And you also have to set up a, um, a centrifuge for it. So we're a ways away from that. I also thought about making a shaft that I can go in and out of so that I could be in vacuum and not have to risk uh, being thrown around. But what I've also noticed is that the atmosphere seems to throw you around more the longer you've been playing. So, if you've been playing for, uh, let's say, an hour, uh, compared to, like, you've just started and you're only 15 minutes in, um, it'll push you around more. Like, the game has only been, on, has, has only been active for about... Ten minutes, uh, and I'm not being blown around nearly as much as I would be if, say, I started mining and it was 45 minutes into the um, into the game. Now that kind of makes me think that there's a rounding error um, in how much pressure affects objects, and I think that perhaps um, as the rounding error accumulates, uh, it just keeps getting worse and worse and worse and worse and worse. Until you're thrown around, because look, look at it, I'm just, 
I'm I'm beating the shit out of this out of this uh, mine, out of this area. I'm also like under my base right now, but oh, there it just threw me out. I guess everything was wrong. Well, it could also be because I was underground. You know what? Let's try that. Where's the base? There's the base. Jetpack on. Uh, okay, this Fight light on. is not is not working. Oop! I found that thing. The power thing. Yeah, now it's starting to blow me around more. I think it was just because I was underground more. Oh, and here's the... Uh, it looks like a time bomb, actually. Uh, the uh, cooler. The, uh, the water thing. Not the water thing, the air conditioner. What are you talking about? So the mine shaft idea might have some merit. Um, I'm gonna put the tape in this hand just in case something happens. That's also why I'm recording, because I'm expecting something to happen. Normally I would pause the recorder, because this is just a lot of shit. Nobody wants to see this. Nobody wants to do this. Ooh. Oh, I need to get out. Jetpack on. As I need to empty the waste tanks. And I also need some oxygen. Oxygen is actually not that hard. I just... Increase this to 10,000. And then quickly go... Pshit! 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 There. Cool. And I didn't bring out the chutes, and I don't care. So where was that gold hiding? Gold was somewhere around here, right? Look at all the holes I've dug. That's not a new one. I looked at that. Not over there. Is it this? No, it wasn't that. It wasn't that. Uh, I don't know where it is. I think maybe that might be a good use for flares. I can throw a flare down when I need to leave a place. Oh no, this is it. This is where the gold was. I have to put this back in my hand.
that scared me. From underneath seems to work a lot better. I seem to have a lot less uh, pick me up and throw me moments. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Jetpack on. Uh, come on, let me out. Jetpack on. I'll grab more gold. Iron is the hardest, or um, lead is the hardest to find. But I think I said that before. Waste tank caution. I knew that was going to happen. Hydration can wait. That was scary. It's time to get the hell out of here. Oh. I seem to have forgotten one. Caution. 
can't cause that. Air tank critical. Okay, so we need to suck in more oxygen on the O2 on the other side. What are we at in here? We're at 30 degrees. Uh, anything else in here? No. Yeah. We're going to open this up. Oh, yes, you are all dicks, every one of you. No, we are not doing that. Anything else in there? Good. Dickwad. There. And here we go. Be nice to have if we had something to store those in. working out good. Do no, I don't really have space in here. Oh, I forgot to turn that off. That was dumb of me. Oxygen critical. Isn't that nice? I'm staying in my helmet for a while. Okay, so... We're filling up in here a bit. Back down to 32 degrees. We're making some, um, gold. Forgot the word that I was looking for for a while. Um, where is the shoots? I don't really want to do this. Nah, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to keep doing it manually. I was going to put the chutes in there and then make a thing, but yeah, we're not going to do that. Let's just eject everything. Keep an eye on it. Okay, so what's steel, copper, iron? There we go. Well, let's make some iron things. And what's that made out of? Copper and iron? Well, let's make some iron things. I decided I was going to make some iron things. And I have to look at the list again. Just a second. So the thing I'm looking at, the thing I'm looking at is my master trade list here. And I have a bunch of things that I. Um, that I wanted to make stuff of. Uh, so frames here. Uh, what is this empty can made out of? Don't tell me it's steel. You, you don't make tin cans out of steel. Uh, okay, iron frames. Uh, these lamps seem to be seems to be. Oh no, they got other stuff in there. 
Uh, so let's make... We have iron frames. We have a dirt... We can make a dirt canister. We can make a chute. We have chutes. Uh, pipe organ. Sign. Mining belt. Passive vent. Like, all of these things are made out of iron. And we can create one, throw it into the vending machine, and see how much the trader will give us for it. Um, all of these should be the exact same value. So they should give us basically just one of any of these things. And uh, we'll see if that holds true. And I'm not entirely convinced that it will. I think those are in tools, though. So... Um, let's go... Nope, it's all screwed up. Okay, so let's go with... Uh, mining belt. And a... Where did wrench go? A wrench. So mining belt. That worked. Uh, a dirt canister. Oops. Wrench. No, no, no. Stop, 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 stop. A dirt canister. Uh, we've got a chute. Mining belt. Uh, bolt cutters. Yeah, that was a weak shot. Bolt cutters. Or nippers. I don't know why you'd use great big huge bolt cutters for a little wire. Uh, what was I saying? I got the wrench. I got the wire cutters. I got the two... Oh, two bolt. Where's the tool belt? Tool belt? Those are huge wire cutters. Okay, so I've got a tool belt, um, a mining belt, wrench, pliers, wrench, Wire cutters, tool belt, mining belt, dirt canister. Okay, so the rest of the stuff is in the pipe bender. And iron. There we go. So let's make a vent. Light on. Passive vent. Uh, is that it? Oh. That's the only thing in here. So I guess... No, it's not. Uh, the chute, I got pipe organ. Let's, let's grab a chute. One chute. And a uh, pipe organ. Pipe organ. Uh, pipe organ. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Looks like a baseball bat. There we go. Uh, passive vent, okay. In the auto lave, we want a sign. I saw the sign. And it cost me four uh, iron. Oh, this is done. There we go.
Oh, no. No. Here we go. And I think that's it for the uh, stuff that's made from three, three iron. So, shut that off. I'm gonna put that over here. Kadunk. And Air shit. Critical. There. Now let's go back outside for a sec. sec. And let's turn this up a little. Get a little more pressure into the uh, into that uh, thing of blob tank. I left this on, I don't know why. I'll also shove in this. There we go. And that's it. Now, those all should be technically the same price, and I don't think they will be. Let's see. So, pipe organ. Pipe organ. It'll give me 11.29 for it. That's not a bad deal. Oh, wire cutters are a lot. Look at that. Wire cutters give me 68 bucks for, and it and it costs me the same amount to make one shoot. Cost me the same amount to make a wrench. Oh, wrench is also high. Iron sheet's not that high. Tool belt. Tool belt costs the same as same amount as the wrench to make in, in resources. So I can make a wrench for... I can sell a wrench for 69. <laughs> 69. Dirt canister costs the same amount, not very much. Uh, $68. Pipe organ was the same amount. Shoot was the same amount. So, um, a wrench or pipe cutters, um, I can sell this guy like gangbusters. Okay, I want. I also want this because you'll give me money for that. Let's start. To, let's get some stuff out of him for a minute here. Okay. We'll, get all, we'll start with all the free stuff. Confirm. Okay, I am going to make one of those things. Oh, first I'm going to... Okay, now I need in plastic. And glass. Power low. Waste tank caution. There we go.
that's of course gonna blow everywhere. So let's spend all of our spend all of our resources on let's make an additional tool belt so we have a thing to hold them in. And then we'll make a bunch of wrenches. So we'll just make wrenches until we run out of resources. And this is done. I said this is done. There we go. Wrench. Put it into belt. And I guess I'm just going to stick all of these back in the same printer right now. Okay, this will be the last wrench. There. And how much is left on this? Stick the rest of that in there. And let's eat. Where's my headlamp go? Oxygen critical. There we go. Where did my headlamp go? I probably threw it in the thing. Yeah, I probably threw it in the thing. Now the thing missing from these doors that I think um, we should have access to is when you push the, the button. There's no, I don't think there is a request to open open um, claws in there. And we'll throw the tool belt in there. Let's see what happens if I throw a tool belt full of wrenches in there. What will happen? So the wrenches, it only says 10. And the tool belt, there's three tool belts. Okay, so it doesn't register that the tool belt has stuff in it. And I'm going to have to exit them all. Nope, nope, no, 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 no. I do want my headlight back, my headlamp back though. No, it's mining. There's my headlamp. Let's just see if one of these is it. Not that one. It is that one. There. Actually, let's throw some wire in there too. So we have one of everything. Now, how much are you going to give me for the wire? Not a lot, but it is better than the price for uh, a wire on its own. Okay, so we sell all of these. It'll give me um, 1200 bucks. We'll keep one of them. Pipes. Actually, that's not a bad price for pipes either. Uh, okay, let's sell that now. Confirm. And I'll pause again. We'll bring back up the trade window. And what is pipes for? Pipes base cost is uh, 0 
and the base cost for the wrench is 3.3. Uh, the wrench takes more time to make. I should have made wire cutters. It doesn't matter. So, a pipe. is six, uh, six times less. And what's our ROI if, where's the wrench? Wrench is $68.99, so $69. And Waste the pipe caution. is eight seventy nine, and I gotta change my pipe, uh, my my thing. Airtag critical. I forgot how much it was now. Uh, pipe is eight seventy eight. Pipes are a better ROI by a little bit. By uh, it's it's six. It's six to it's seven to six or six to seven would be the it would be the ROI. So let's sell all of you and keep one of you. Oh God damn it! Uh, and I'm not going to sell these cards because these cards are very underpriced. But I am going to buy Hastaloy, Inconel, Electrium, Invar, Waspaloy, Solder. I think that's it. Don't need the lead. Hasselhoi. Invar. Okay. Confirmed. Get off my pad. Cool. Uh, now I need... Let's leave that in there. Let's pull, what's that? Let's pull whatever this is out. Pull that out. Pull that out. We'll pull that out. Oh, 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 get back here. Uh, we'll pull the potato seeds out, because we'll need those. We'll pull the wasp alloy out. I think that's wasp alloy. Yeah. We won't use this until we have a centrifuge. Oh, oh no, oh no, where'd it go? Oh, there's only one. Is that it? Oh, no. Green guy. Yellow guy. Yeah, yellow guy's the only one left. <clears throat> or the only spot that we have left. So let's close this. Waste tank caution. Filter low. Okay, so 
dump you. We'll grab you. And let's see how hot this is. Oh. 80 degrees. Eh. Yeah. It'd been nicer if it was like hotter than it is outside. But it's not. What are you doing? Don't do that. Okay. So. I think I forgot to turn everything off out there, but it doesn't super matter. Okay, this is nitrice. So it'll be nitrogen. Okay, all of those things can come out here. We'll put more of that in there. Actually, no, I don't want to do that. I'll, I'll release it in here because I don't want to risk heating it up at all. I thought I had some oxide in there too. Light on. Oh no, keep going. Okay. So now it's gonna be mostly Yeah, there's a lot of nitrogen in here. Now I'm pretty sure there's there was oxide in there. Let's go check. What's everybody at? Everybody looks fine. So things will be okie dokie. Air tank critical. We can turn that off. Okay. Too well. Okay. Uh, let's back up a bit so we can get this. There. How much is in there? Oh, there's stuff in there. There we go. And... Wire, wire. Okay, nothing else in there that's of any use. Now, we can release the oxalite in here. And we'll determine... Okay, we'll wait for this. Oh, that is finished. Okay, good. And then we'll change over... the uh, noxide for that. And then we will vent the volatiles in here. There we go. Perfect. Now there shouldn't be any volatiles in the atmosphere. There isn't, but... Oh, it's only 28 degrees. Uh, I thought it would be a little less. I thought we'd have better. And I think that we can... We can breathe normally now. Yes, we can, 27%. Light on. Perfect. Now we have a bunch of gold and... Uh, we have a bunch of gold and a little bit of iron. 
so we'll need a more mine more iron. But uh, we should be doing pretty good. Our tiny bit of iron are here. Now, did besides the coal, did anything else end up anywhere else? No. And we. Where's the potatoes? Oh, there's the potatoes. Oh, no. We're not going to do potatoes yet. I want the control. Oh, I see. There we go. And do we have a programmer? No, we don't have a program board. So let's get the... Editor. Once the once the uh, the chip is done printing, new, 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 new. Okay, there we go. Uh, editor, go. And the two inputs that I need is. Oh, I need. Uh, wire stick you in here for now and you my freddy friend are going in here and I will need cable here we go I don't know why I'm talking like this I think I have brain damage Why did you do that to me? That's good enough. Thanks. Okay, let's turn the computer on. And we will switch to the housing. And we will open this up. Pause the game as I load up my... Uh, my... Copy here. Oops. No. Wrong. Wrong, clear. I have to take out the comments. There, at the bottom. There. Okay, that seems like everybody's real right. Yeah, yeah, there's no errors. Right. Power down. Oh, maybe it has to be on. Error on line 23. Now what's wrong with line 23? Line 23 says... Oh, I haven't said anything. That's why line 23 says nothing. Uh, we want the hydroponic device. No. Hydroponic. Hydroponic. And I'm probably going to change this code so you no longer have to put the light in there. That it'll just be... It'll just try to control... If the... Um, um, if the hash is for the hydroponic station, it'll just turn the hydroponic station light on and off. And if the hash is... No, that's not going to work. I'll figure it out. And we need potatoes. There. Now, let's see if there's anybody in the neighborhood we can steal from. That's the wrong card. It's not really a motherboard. It's sort of an I.O. board. Small satellite dish on. Okay, so the uh, the dish is glitched. That means the next time I want to reload, it's going to be a um um 
three fresh people. And I can load scum to get whoever I want. But I don't know who I want. Uh, can I make any more mods? Mods. Let's go for the mod for the electronics printer. You need Constantine. I don't have Constantine. I don't have enough. I only got six. So, mod. Uh, Autolathe. Nope, need Constantine. Tried that. Uh, pipe bender. Constantine again. Tool printer. You're a jerk. What's down here? Oh, these are all the modules. Okay. Okay, big battery charger is going to go outside, probably. Or should it go inside? Nah, no, it should go outside. If I put it inside, what's it going to do? I still have emergency access to that battery, so yeah, I can go inside. And it's probably going to go, like, right here or something. Like, right there. Because then I can attach it to the, um, uh, to the main bus out there. I'll figure it out. And I'm probably going to make a bunch of, of large batteries. And upgrade everybody off of the small batteries. Yeah. And I also need to upgrade my power grid, but uh, that doesn't super matter right now. Um, I think that will be it for now, because uh, I, I showed some mining, and uh, that's fine. Oh god, I wish I, could, I wish I could tell what the temperature of the tank was. That would be nice. But I can't do that right now. Oh, 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 I know. Um, no, we'll do that next time. I'm going to take this gas. Except for the X, or maybe including the X. And I'm going to inject it into that tank over there. And I might take it outside to do that. But I'll have like seconds to do it if I take it outside. And then once I do that... Actually, I can turn this off now because I've already cycled everything. And uh, I'm just going to throw my suit right here. Uh, once I get everything set up out there... Or maybe not out there. Maybe I'll just... Stick it right here. Yeah, that's better. I'll stick it right here. Do I have facilities to stick it right there? Yeah, but I'll still need... I'll need to get... Um, Hydration critical. I'll need to get iron. Because I need to um, build more pipe. I sold all my pipe. Most of my pipe. So I get iron. I'll build out... Um, into the uh, thing of a blobber, the tank, and then I I can I can suck out the uh, the the contents of the um. Oh yeah, this is over here too. Is this two spaces here? No, I don't think that's two spaces. I think that's just one space. Yeah, that's one space. That where it is sucks. And it's got to move. Actually, this whole computer's got to move, too. Yeah, I'm going to expand this side tomorrow. I might expand one out here, because I've got... i got 119 kilopascals, so that should be fine. 
because then that'll give me four wide, which is what I want. Yeah, that's what I'll do. That will be the uh, uh, what will happen in the next episode. Um, let's just take another look at that um, that cheat sheet. So uh, I don't know if I discussed this before. I discussed this um, one of the videos that I deleted, but um, all of this list comes from the trader uh, directory thing. And there is some arbitrary numbers in there that may not be useful, may not be used, but these are the numbers that are in the tradables. And I use that to give value to um, how much each one of these um, one of these things are. And I will add one more value onto this. I will say uh, plus energy divided by um, let's say a thousand because most of them are a thousand. Okay, then we'll add that number to here. Actually, most of them are 100. Whatever. I'm sure they don't give you much for power. Paste. Yeah, so that increases value just a tiny bit more. And we'll go by 100. Why be so stingy? This way, it'll affect these guys a little tiny bit more. There we go. So now we have a new uh, a new baseline for how much everything costs in terms of like um, resources and energy. Probably could add time in there too, but that's getting a little greedy. It takes one second to make a battery charger? Uh, let's re-sort all of these, and then we'll go through them. Column C, okay. There. So, uh, what the most expensive thing up here is, of course, is the large satellite dish. Because it takes the most amount of resources, most amount of energy. Not the most amount of time, but whatever. Um, and then you got the, the rocket parts. But this is just a loose value. It doesn't seem like the traders are sticking to this in any way. There could be a lot of modifiers for the individual um, components. But when you get to very basic um, materials like ores and um, ingots, they seem to be um, a locked in value. So if you have these three ingots here, these three super, uh, uh, this one, this one, this one, and this one, these four super alloys, um, if they're selling it, I think it's the same price uh, we just saw. You can check again. There are different uh, different number of grams, but um, they'll be about the same. If you look at like um, lead or yeah, electrium and um, silver, uh, solder and invar, they'll be the same price um, as well. And you can see that more when you when you're trying to sell it to them. It seems that the prices are a little more stable than if you're buying it from them. It seems to be very unstable if you're buying it from them. Also, if they're selling something, you can sell it to them for more, which seems sort of counterintuitive. So like if that, uh, when that trader is selling us um, iron, if it, okay, say that trader wasn't selling us iron, one ingot would have been like 30 cents or something like that, or 20 cents. But since he was selling it to us, it was as much as, as $5. So um, if the trader is selling it, you can get it for more because then it, it ends up in the same the same line. And I think there is some sort of calculus between how much they sell something for and how much they purchase something for. Um, there also seems to be um, that, that doesn't work for batteries because batteries have a charge and batteries have a separate category. 
because they have charge. So anything that has charges in it or has uh, gas in it will be added as a separate line item. And those line items then um, have, have different values. The calculus gets put on it differently. But things that don't have values on it, like... Um, uh, the sorter card. Sorter card is something that the internet said was good to um, good to sell, but uh, you can get a much higher ROI on some other stuff. You can just uh, look. You can compare how much they're trading um, certain things uh, based on um, you know these arbitrary values here, and then see if your ROI is higher or lower, or if you're selling something that's just like uh, one resource, what the ROI is. ROI means return on investment. Um, there are very few things that are made out of just one type of material. Uh, iron is the big one. I think there's a few things that are just made out of steel. I'm not 100% certain. But you can you can figure it out what will get you the highest return on investment. And you can... Um, completely soak the traders they uh, if you sell them one item or a thousand items or a hundred thousand items they don't know they don't care they will give you the same amount of money and you can sell a bunch of items to them and say you want more you can just shove more into the vending machine it doesn't change the only thing that changes it is if the item if the if the trader leaves and comes back and then the um the value list gets shuffled. Now, I'm positive that they're using some kind of calculus uh, like this, and basically this is just, you know, um, uh, this field times um, this amount. So, it, it, I don't have it set up to do that. You can, and it doesn't matter. But, but that's basically what the calculus is, and I think energy is applied somewhere. I looked in the code uh, in the C sharp dill, and it seems like energy does matter, especially for batteries. But the other stuff is a little more opaque. They uh, they try to make their 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 code as opaque as possible. Uh, but you know you can download a a dot peak thing and look at it to see what it is. But this is this is basically it. There may also be um, a benefit depending on which printer is used. So if you're trying to sell them something that's printed out of an auto lathe that has, say, a similar value to um, something printed out of the pipe bender, like this uh, volatile uh, uh, filter uh, compared to... Jesus, a volatile... Okay, I think my calculator, something's wrong with my calculator. Because it is telling me that the Volatiles filter has the same value as a, as a printer. A large, a large Volatile gas filter has the same intrinsic value as an Autolathe? Yeah, that doesn't make any sense to me. But I mean, like, that's the kind of thing. Like... Technically, these have the t these two have the same value to them, so um, it's probably much more likely that you'll get more for the volatile gas rather than the printer, which seems ridiculous. But or this uh, wind turbine, the turbine generator. I think that's the one with uh, that you uh, that you blow air through, uh, not the stand up turbines, um, and the airlock. Um, door have almost the same value you probably get more for the turbine because it's the electronics printer and the pipe bender, bender is something that you get first kind of thing so i i think there is some sort of um some sort of difference in the price that you get for each one of these printers but probably not and there's probably also a modifier uh if you have um an upgrade or not because this seems ridiculous like um, a motherboard, a logic motherboard, ha is um, has less intrinsic value than a crate Mark II, which you have to have an upgrade for. Like that seems nuts, and I don't even know what the crate Mark II is. Like, is that one that that 
doesn't leak when you put uh, um, uh, when you put items into it. Like, who the hell knows? So, so this is this is definitely arbitrary, especially because I put um, energy in there as a as a modifier. I might put this on um, my Google Drive if you want to download it. So there may be a link in the description if you just want to look at this. Um, uh, this has been accumulated over all of the um, all of the recipes, and uh, we'll pause for a second just once again. And I also have this file that I might put up, which is an updated file for the fabricator. And I also have um, an insert for the fabricator uh, to put into the auto lathe or electronic printer uh, recipe list that allows you to print out a fabricator in your normal um, survival game. And you will have access to all of the normal um, items. You probably won't be able to print out the lander. I don't think the lander, not the lander, the um, the rover is in here. Just look if rover is in there. Oh, rover is in there. Oh, I guess you can print out the rover normally. I thought that was removed from the game. But um, uh, you can print that out norm normally. And the, uh, the fabricator. Oops, not that one. Okay, here's the here's the fabricator. If you want to print out more than one fabricator, in case you want to print out a lot of different things, you can have more than one fabricator. I hate having more than one printer. Um, what I did to come up with this recipe is I just added the cost of all the printers and all the mods together, and that's what that's what came up. And I chose 180 seconds as as an arbitrary time because that's how much one of the other printers uh, printed it out for. So I'll probably put that on my Google Drive um, if you want to uh, download this as well. I am not sure how to add this in as a mod because these are configuration files and not um, not scripts. So there's a different method to put that onto the um, the workshop. I have done it before for um, oxygen not included. I've I've uploaded mods on there, but uh, for stationers, I'd have to look it up. And I'm not super motivated to do that because I'm just not super motivated to do that. Um, if it's not in the descriptor and you really want a descriptor uh, and you really want it, uh, harass me a little and I'll put it on the on the descriptor. Anyways, see you later.